rocks and together at the same time that the music really starts to hit. Then, 10 days before school starts, it's time for band camp. That's when the 270 members of the band report to campus and everything is put together. The music, the marches, and the formations. And during that week, we'll learn our first two major shows, plus uh, our pregame show. And we'll also play through most of the music for the rest of the season. Henderson says a lot of hours are spent practicing, not only during band camp, but during the season as well. Well, and at band camp, we're uh, working from like 8.30 in the morning till about 9 or 9.30 or so at night. And uh, so it's a good 12-hour day we're spending at camp. Once we get out of camp, we're uh, looking at a 5 o'clock to 6 o'clock rehearsal every day during the school year, Monday through Friday. One of the crowd favorites at Kentucky is the famed Marching K. It's also one of the band's favorites. One year we actually weren't going to do the K, and we were going to spill cats and march that up and down the field. So we set up cats and we marched it up and down the field, and the band revolted. They said, nope, we're not going to do that. No, we're going to do the Marching K. Put it back in the show. And so like the week before the first home game, we had to just uh, stop what we were doing and put the K back in and throw that out. So it's a... Uh, some things, uh, we can't push past the band like that. We just have to stay with the tradition. Practice sessions aren't always fun. There are a lot of kinks to work out, a lot of lines to straighten, and a lot of corrections to be made. This has got to go farther back. Brent, where you are, that's got to go farther back. Somehow, from all the confusion of practice, a show is developed. And that's when the hours of drills, the sweat, and the tears pay off. Kentucky's band is known for drawing great crowd response. Many times when it goes on the road, its halftime show generates a standing ovation. Henderson says that's because the Wildcat Marching Band likes to vary its sound and style. He says the crowd seem to enjoy the upbeat music the best. The crowd relates to the, the um, I guess, uh, the faster, uh, more exciting type music. But plus the band relates to it. I think that's the really more important thing. And we try to get a variety. So if somebody just really doesn't like chicory or doesn't like what the band's going to do if they don't recognize the melody, then we do something in the show for those people. And we try to do something, maybe a little bit for everybody, but try to make it all exciting to some degree. This is Brad Davis reporting from Lexington, Kentucky.